Hey guys, welcome back to my channel, Tomo here. Uh, first of all, I just want to say a quick thanks to all of you guys and all your support that you always give me. I'm always happy for it, and that's why I give you the giveaways and I give you what you can. Uh, the reason for this video is, recently uh, I've been getting a few requests, and one request that stuck out was one guy was asking me if I could give him some tips. Now, I haven't actually done this before, it's quite a new thing for me. So this will be my first. I thought, yeah, why not, I'll give it a go. Uh, the guy is I'm trying to think what rank he was. His name is June Kip. He's been on some of my giveaways, and he uh, he said he's gold no golden over two, and he's uh, been soloing quite a lot. And he's wondering if he had any tips to try and help him get out there. So I thought, yeah, okay, I'll do it. I'll give him try and give him a hand. And I'm not the best. Although I'm at Ellie at the moment, and I've got the mass experience. But he asked me, so I thought I'll just give it a go and see if I can help him out. So the first thing I would I would recommend for him would be to queue with people you know, just try and find a couple of friends. Even if it's one or two, that will make a massive difference. We've all been on there when uh, guys have just been salty, been toxic, and all they've done is complain and moan, they haven't paid as a team. And so it's just, everyone gets games as well where guys just disappear, they just go and you're left with a bot and sometimes two bots. So you try and find yourself a nice team there because you'll work better. Uh, Another thing you want to try doing is understanding the buy as well. Um, not just your buy, but understanding the enemy's economy. If if you know that they've just they've been getting, in fact, if you know that they're low on the economy and they managed to win one, then you win one again. You know they're going to have to save because their money's going to be reset. So you want to you want to try and learn what sort of money bonuses they're going to get for losing. And if you know they're on an eco, try and buy a high high reward weapon system. You know like the SMGs. You've got the uh, MP7s, MP9s, UMPs, try and buy things like that because then your money bonus yourself will be a lot higher, I'll give you a lot more cash. Um, you also want to learn, well, take every map as you can, but try and learn them one at a time. Try and learn the decent nade spots. Try and learn the perfect perfect spots to uh, to throw a molly or a nade or a smoke from inside cover. Um, especially on maps where you know it's a really, really, really easy way for say like the terrorists to rush you want to you want to money those places because if it doesn't stop them it's still going to take down a lot of their health so you give them a quick spray it should kill them uh, especially smoke smoke's really important especially if there's enemy orpers on there and they've got good orper you want to smoke them off straight away uh, you, you always want to be a good teammate the worst thing you want to do is start raging if you start raging other people will start raging and next thing you know you've got five guys on a team that are all fighting each other and they usually all team up on one and it's 4v1 screaming at each other the next thing you know, people just go rogue and just go and do what they want, and they don't really start playing as a team. So, if you do, it happens to me as well. If, if I do something bad, I make sure I don't do it on the voice comms. I just get it out of my system really quick. By the time the next round started, you know you're ready to go again, so you can get your mind back in the game, try and leave it behind, and get back straight into it. What you want to do? The obvious one that everyone's always going to say is you need to practice, 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 practice your corners, practice your peaking. Remember to never re-peek. If you peek somewhere and you don't get them and they know you're there, don't re-peek. Especially if it's an orc, because if they know you're coming, they know exactly where they are, they can line up the headshot and they'll get you. Uh, uh, where was I? Practice, practice. Yeah, I'm doing this all in one go, by the way, so if I make a mistake, you're all going to hear it, but I'm just going to go through with it. Uh, practice, practice, practice. Uh, another good thing you could do is, you know, many guys say it, many pros say it, many YouTube say it, is just watching pros. I always make sure I watch uh, majors and things like that, just so I can learn a few little hints. It doesn't make you elite, but you get a few little hints like that. Right, guys, I hope that will help you anyway. If you guys think I could have done that better or any worse or any hints, let me know. Or contact me and send me an email and tell me what you think. Cheers, guys. Yeah.